Hey, what's going on, everybody? It's Mike, KD2KOG, part of the technical support staff here at SDRplay.com. I'm going to do a quick part two because it's 20 to 9 Eastern Standard Time, which should be uh, close to 0041 UTC. So let's take a look at signals on HF using the Benito Megaloop ML200. And I'm going to try the Volmets now. Now, conditions are not that great. But this thing is really pulling in signals well. If you see my uh, spectrum noise floor here bouncing, it's because thunderstorms are rolling in here in South Florida. So let me unmute this. Let's pull up some Volmet frequencies. And we'll check Gander. We'll check Shannon. We'll check the RAF. We'll check Trenton. And let's see how they, let's see how they do. All right, let's start from the bottom. All right, that's Shannon. That's really weak. That's always been a weak low band, especially at night. All right, that's the RAF. Shannon, Ireland. And like I said earlier, look at how linear this noise floor is. The, not the noise floor, the actual spectrum. How nice and linear and flat and how well these signals are popping out. Now the W6LVP loop did give me an, a linear noise floor, but on the lower bands, I had some issues in certain portions of the band. And like I said earlier, this spectrum bouncing is thunderstorms are rolling in. And nothing from Gander right now. Let's try Trenton. Weak, but picking them up. Also weak, but we're picking them up. Right, let's undo the notch. Check for UVB76. Yeah, it's there. There's the buzzer. Extremely hard station for me to pick up. Let's see if 4XZ is uh, sounding off out of Israel. That one is weak, but we're picking it up. Oh, that's cheating. I'm enabling the CW peak. Let's not enable that because that's just going to boost it. So far, so good. All right, we checked the Volmets. We checked oddities. Let's check. Uh, let's check the time stations. CHU. Very good. Let's check RWM out of Russia. Very hard for me to pick up also. And we're picking that time station up. That's Russia. <laughs> I'm surprised. I've never picked this one up this low. 
And let's go for the last one. It might not be transmitting. Let's try WWVs. Nothing on 2-5. Weak on 5. 10 is good. Let's take a look at the Marine Band. Alright, St. John's, that should be, I believe, out of Canada. Or Maine, or in that area. Very weak, but we're resolving audio. Tough station to pick up. Let's see on the other one. Pacific Coast? I doubt it. Now, see this noise here. Let's see if the wide noise blanker will eliminate that noise. That could be from the air conditioning units. Can't be that sir, who knows why be a noise blanker, because it's phenomenal. From that to that. Let's see if we can tighten it up just a hair. Yeah. So that's most likely coming from the air con I hope you guys can hear me. That's most likely coming from the air conditioning units. I don't think anything from the Coast Guard is going to be sounding off now. Let's check. Uh, that's really good. Let's check Navtex. Very good. All right, military. I don't think anything's gonna be going on uh, HF GCS. So, oh wow! <laughs> One, Let's check them two, all. Three, three. Oh, out. oh, he just signed off. Check our broadcast stations. See Voice of Greece. Now, just for you guys know, you might be seeing my signal and saying, wow, the signal's not that strong. It's not about signal. It's about signal to noise ratio. Signal is good, but noise also creates signal. You want a really, really high SNR. And that's what we're aiming for here. If, if you can see, let me see if I can zoom in. I don't remember the keyboard. Oh, it's window. If you see here, the SNR we're aiming for, the SNR we're aiming for, I can't even talk. What we're aiming for is a high SNR. Don't mind this S meter. S meter is great, but it's just an S meter. When you're trying to adjust for a signal, you're, you want to increase the SNR, so you want to keep an eye on the noise floor and you want to keep a, an eye on the peak of the carrier and you want to try to bring the gain up as high as possible with peaking this carrier and trying not to peak the noise floor. So there's a little quick lesson. Let's uh, put ourselves back to normal and go back to Voice of Greece and we'll tune it in the center. from 23 to 28. All right. Mighty KBC. All 
All right, guys. Hopefully this convinces you how phenomenal this antenna is. And like I said, it's all about SNR. And I think Dennis pushes the, the SNR in his sales sheets and all that. And, you know, I would look at that and go, ah, SNR. Believe me, this antenna, huge difference. Dennis, two thumbs up, buddy. Phenomenal antenna. See you guys in the next one. 73, enjoy the bands. Have a great weekend.